This is the Tangstar Science Cells Task Card with Game Board. This set contains 80 task cards, and unlike most task card sets which are printed 4 to a page, this one's printed 8 to a page to help save on printing, paper, and laminating costs. I've also provided answers to each task card, which can be printed on the back if you want to turn these into flashcards. Otherwise, a full answer key is provided. When printed and cut, you can hole punch the corner to create a space to put through a binder ring, which will keep the set together. This way you won't lose any cards. So you can have the students keep them together, or you can separate them and reassemble them in the end. Now I've also provided a cover card so that each set can be easily identified. Now when it comes to adding cards, I've made this easy by providing an editable document that allows you to add questions to the set if you so choose. Now, if you're using these as regular task cards without the answers on the back, I've also provided a student worksheet that will allow students to record their answers. Now, some of the task cards require that students answer questions based on this diagram that I have provided with the documents. It contains the full animal cell and plant cell diagram with the labels, so that some questions might say, uh, locate structure N. Uh, name it and provide its function. So some of the questions might be like that. So this allows students to have some practice identifying organelles in diagrams. Now all you need to do to make the game board work is to provide uh, game pieces, a die, and a timer. Now you can use any type of game pieces you have available. When it comes to the timer you can use your wristwatch or they can use their cell phone timers if you allow them to use that. Now this game board transforms the task card set into an extremely fun and engaging review game and students will stay on task and enjoy themselves while reviewing and reinforcing their understanding of cells, their structures and functions. Now let's take a tour of this game board. So let's zoom in. And as you can see, when it comes to the steps of the game board, what I've done is I've made each step represented by a mitochondrion. Now there's a start, and this is their goal, the finish. Now there's different uh, aspects of this game that end up heightening the drama a bit and then make it a little bit of fun. I've provided glucose molecules along the way so that if they land on a glucose molecule and they answer correctly, they can then take another turn or they can choose another player to lose their turn. If they answer incorrectly, they move back. If they end up on landing on a lysosome, this means that they have to answer two questions correctly to stay in this position. Otherwise, if they answer incorrectly, they move back. Now, when it comes to winning, they do not have to have an exact roll of the dice because that can get very frustrating for students. So let's say, for example, they're right here. They don't have to roll a two to get to the finish. They can roll anything that's two or above. Okay. Now once you have your materials printed and the task card set is complete, you'll get a lot of mileage from this set for years to come. The students will love this. So this is Tankstar Science. Thanks for watching this video.